welcome to another video, another week. So for today's video, I thought it would be fun or interesting to share some stuff that I got at Deskim slash clicks. So it's month end, we usually do like our toiletries shopping around this time for the next month. But also sometimes we do have things left from the previous month and don't need as many things for the next month. Anyway, but I went yesterday and got some stuff and I thought I will just share it on here. And also these are not like out of the ordinary stuff. These are very normal like toiletry stuff that everyone gets or majority of people get. It's not like fancy stuff or anything, but I thought I'd just share some stuff that we tend to buy so i will also try to link the items that i bought if i can find them online and also we got majority of stuff on like deals so this kim has some if you buy three you only pay for two and clicks also has that same deal so i don't know when the video goes up if those deals will still apply but they anyway have them like pretty frequently to be honest with you so if you don't buy it now, I'm sure it go. It will go on a deal again in the future. Anyway, so I'm going to start with stuff that we got at this game first. So first up, and sorry if you can hear the wind and whatever. It's very very intense today, and because we're so high up, you can really hear the wind, and you can also feel the wind. To be honest with you, it feels like the building is doing this a little bit, which is pretty suspect but anyway so sorry for the background noise in terms of the wind but yeah first up I got another one of these so I got the Catrice True Skin Hydrating Foundation I spoke about this foundation in the previous video where I have my favorite makeup items currently and this is by far at this point in time my favorite foundation so i just grabbed another one because they are always sold out in this color so i just thought grab while they have some otherwise what if i run out and i don't have any more so yeah i got this okay next up maybe not a really exciting thing but we got earbuds and the earbuds that i usually go for are like the paper ones i don't like the earbuds with the plastic part in the middle so this is, I don't know, it says made using recycled paper. So it is cotton buds like this. This is what it looks like. And then, as you can see there, that's paper. It's not the plastic, which is obviously amazing. And yeah, it looks like it's made for Diskim. I think it's maybe, you know, an in-house brand situation. But yeah, so I got a big one of these. There's 300 of them. So I got that. Then next up, I don't know really. Um, I, I know why we bought this, but anyway, this is a container of like activated charcoal. So Jason wanted to try this out. Apparently charcoal is good for everything. So I think this was pretty cheap, like 17 Rand for this. And you just mix it with water and then you kind of just drink it quickly. And it just helps with like your tummy and your skin and basically your whole digestive system so we got uh, this you do get the charcoal pills that you can drink but i thought maybe the powder like that you like mix as a paste or whatever might be digested quicker and easier so maybe it has a better effect but yeah it was pretty inexpensive so we're going to try this out then next up as we're on the topic of charcoal we got toothpaste so we do really like the charcoal toothpaste the different brands it doesn't be, need to be brand specific but we at this came that a three for two you know that special so we got this colgate charcoal toothpaste and we got two of them and then we got also this one hemp seed oil which i haven't tried before so that's the one we're going to do and then let's see if that one's tasty. I don't know if I'm going to like the same seed oil one, but we really like the chocolate ones. Okay, next item. So, or items. 
they also had a three for two on the like body wash and soaps and stuff like that so this is one of my favorite ones and this is the the sanix zero so i really really like this body wash it has no fragrances no nothing no funny stuff in it and i just feel that this just i don't know is very non-irritating to my skin because some soaps dry my skin out and all those kind of things so i really do like these and we've got the big ones which is 750 mils it is a smaller one as well but we got three of these so this is a good deal and this also lasts very long because you don't have to put that much on um it like it's pretty nice and foamy so yeah got these they also have a different Sanic Zero that has like an orange label. I don't know what that is, but we usually get this one for sensitive skin. Then back onto makeup. I have also spoken about this before. This is the BB cream that I always use and it has a SPF 50 in. So when you put your normal SPF on and this on, it's really nice. So this is the Vichy UV Protect BB cream, like I said, SPF 50. And yeah, just a very nice one. I only have one shade in this so yeah and i really like to when i go like exercise and stuff sometimes you just want something on your skin and um, then i'll maybe just add some of it under my eyes or whatever like that but i stick to this bb cream i i just feel like it's pretty long wearing um but it's nice and thin so it's not as thick as like foundation and stuff so also when we go to the beach and i don't want to wear like makeup makeup like foundation then I put my sunscreen on and then I put this one on as well and that works really 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 nicely so I got one this I think there was a 20% of all of this brand's product so I got one of these then next up this is pretty random but this really we buy every month and this is the elastoplast knee and elbow plasters I buy this all the time just because some of my shoes like my sneakers they tend to hurt me in the back of my ankle so I have to always have some of these on hand and I do just prefer the knee and elbow because it's just the perfect size and shape so I always keep these like in my handbag and stuff like that for if my shoes start hurting me that I can put that on so that's why we go we actually go through these quite quickly um, but yeah so we always buy these plasters then next up this is pretty exciting so I as you can see now I have like nail polish on my nails I do my own gel nails I did a video on that but I have wanted to try the impress press on manicures for a very long time and I've seen some collabs that a lot of youtubers did with impress um, we don't have those um, packets here I don't know a little bit behind but we do have the standard impress impress nails so I got this one and you can see the shades and stuff in it it's just like the bottom ones are glitter and then the top ones are just like a plain nude color and you basically peel off the sticker thing and then you just press it on and there's 30 nails in here so these are very nice so there's no like actual glue that comes with the packets so i am very excited to try this out once this kind of wears out so or like grows out i'm gonna try and put these on and i think there was also 20 percent of these impress nail kits i think actually at Diskim and it clicks but i got this at Diskim. then lastly um i think this is the last item yeah from this game that i got was the birds bees like lip balm so i think in every single video i've filmed i mentioned that i like lip balm and my lips are very dry all the time and i do like the libello i've spoken about it before i really like that and always when there's like a deal for, you know two for one or whatever i buy those but birds bees had a deal on and yeah they have vanilla and then they have other flavors so i took the vanilla one and that's that and I do know that Birds Bees like is pretty like you know famous for being very hydrating so I decided to get another lip balm my handbag is like 
full of lip balms but i'm excited to to try this one out so that's the roundup of the stuff that we got from Deskim, except for toilet paper we also got because they're a really good deal on toilet paper so but i didn't feel the need to show it on here um yeah so like i said i usually go between clicks and Deskim. it depends on who has deals on whatever products i need so that's kind of how we go. So we we'll usually go to a mall where there's a disc game and a clicks pretty close by and I can like jump in between. Um, I, I try to look online prior to going, but I don't know, sometimes the stuff online is different to the stuff that's in store. So yeah, and I do like to shop for toiletries. I also like to shop for groceries. I like to go as much as the online delivery is very convenient and we sometimes do that if we really don't have the time or whatever um, but I do like to go and stroll around as well find it pretty like therapeutic or whatever so yeah that was it for this game we didn't need a lot of things um, we sometimes you know like I said you know I saw we bought three body washes three toothpaste or whatever so then you know we might not need that again very soon so then you know the next time we go we might buy other things again so anyway every month looks a little bit different but we tend to gravitate towards the same products every month we kind of figure out what we like and we stick to those moving on to what we got from clicks so that was more makeup stuff for me not really anything for jason necessarily but first up is i needed a highlighter and like a contour like a bronzer situation and I do have that Urban Decay palette that has all three like shades in it like a bronzer and a blush and like a I don't know like an under eye part or whatever and that works great but it's almost done <laughs> like there's not that many like that much product in it's also expensive so and i also think they discontinued it because i couldn't find it on their site again so anyway i just default back to what i know and that's the wet and wild contour palette which is this one which i have used before and it is like it's really good and i've also heard a lot of other people that you know like youtubers that review makeup really like love this one and it's very affordable so i always go for this one the only thing is I used to not like the like packaging because the stuff here tend to break but I also used to carry these in a makeup bag all the time and I think it like just got like squished in there and stuff where now I have like more like a makeup counter section so it's like more in its own spot and so hopefully the packaging lasts a little bit longer and then for highlighter I know Wet n Wild makes really really great highlighters so i just also went for this um very very nice highlighter and yeah i always like wet n wild's products and i think they're pretty cheap so i got this at clicks because i don't think this game actually stocks wet n wild then i did run out of brow products and i showed this on my i think on my favorites video of my makeup favorites video but I use this Makeup Revolution like brow pencil, which has like a, you know, the actual brow product and then like a little brush. And they basically only had one left at clicks. So I got it in the shade, what is this one? Medium brown. I think the other one I had was dark brown. Now I got medium, so let's see how it goes. But yeah, I really like this brow product and I do like the fact that it has the brush on the other end. So, yep, I got that also from Clicks. Then, next up, I have some hairspray. I got the big bottle of Tresemme Firm Hold Hairspray. So, it's just this one. Um, I really like to have these. Well, first of all, because I spray sometimes some of the flowers, like, well, like the dried flowers, pompous, and those things. I spray with hairspray because then if the wind blows, the little feathers and stuff doesn't go everywhere. And then also, if you want to do like a sleek back hairdo situation, um, it's always nice to have hairspray because I have like a lot of like loose, like small bits here, like baby hair situations, and then it doesn't all like come together. Anyway, so I have hairspray for that, especially when you like your hair is like dirty, but you're not ready to wash it yet. 
um, but you can't just wear it like it is then I usually try and do some kind of hair do with, with hairspray anyway so I got a big bottle of this and then also my favorite dry shampoo this is just the original Batiste dry shampoo that I've always used I did I did attempt some other brands of dry shampoo I think which ones was it I can't remember but there's some other brands as well which is a little bit like cheaper than this one but none of them I really like that much so I feel like they didn't do as much for my hair as I wanted them to do so yeah so I just default back to this one it is a little bit expensive in my opinion but I just I don't want to wash my hair every single day so yeah anyway so this really comes in handy I go through it quite quickly I must say and they don't always have like a spe special on it like a 3 for 2 situation so it does work out a little bit expensive but yeah I don't want to wash my hair every day I'm trying to not to because my hair is a very sad situation lately and I don't really know how to fix it but yeah then lastly we come to the end of this haul and this is I'm quite excited about this so I don't know this brand at all but I've heard on the internet people speak about it but I think the name is pronounced Kristen S which looks like this and this is a shampoo and a conditioner so this is a purple shampoo and a purple conditioner the packaging was the thing that really like attracted me and like was like cool you're gonna buy this uh, these are sulfate free shampoos and conditioners and like go look, I don't know if clicks has this online if it's only in store but the packaging is beautiful as you can see this packaging but they have all the different like scenarios for your hair like curly or like the dry shampoo or the serums it's different colors so there's like white and then this color and like a dark green and whatever so it's really really pretty and like I said I think that's why I bought it but it is the purple shampoo and purple conditioner which I obviously have to use for my hair color and I like that it's sulfate free so this is going to be very interesting to use to see if it actually you know it's different to any other shampoo that I'm using because I am very desperate to find a shampoo that's really good um, or just like hair products in general like I do use masks and stuff and they tend to make it feel like nice and whatever but I don't really know I don't really know what's happening with my hair anyway so so yeah so I'm trying everything and anything at this point um, but like I said the packaging is very pretty so and it's also the bottles are like like squishy it's not like very like you know it's almost like jelly anyway so go have a look at this this is very nice but yeah I didn't I don't know this brand it says it's made in the USA so um, so yeah I don't, also don't know if this is new and if, if it's always been there and this is the first time that I've seen it but yeah very excited to try this out for, for, my, ne for my next hair wash session so yes that concludes clicks stuff that I bought um, we what we did see is that there was a lot of deals that was really similar between Diskim and clicks so there was the toothpaste was the same at clicks that it was a Diskim so I just I do know that Diskim sells different makeup brands to clicks some are the same and some's not so it depends on what you're looking for but yeah I like I say jump in between like both and kind of see where I can get the best deals and where my like most loved products are stocked at so that's it that's what we bought this month everything else we were covered for so yeah I always like to watch these like like toiletry hauls if you want to call it toiletry haul that sounds a little weird but like I just like to watch people's makeup and like shampoos and like basically any odd thing that they buy that they think is really great because that's usually how I learn about different products and maybe you know I'm looking for a cream and if you are using that cream and suggesting it then I like to try those things out I always like to try new things out but yeah these are kind of semi majority of these are like standard stuff that we would buy and then if I do see the odd thing that is exciting like these then I would just kind of 
buy them like once off and see you know do i like it do i not and then you know it depends if i would buy them then next time we go but yeah so and also like with our toiletries i don't know I, we tend to only have to go, you know like go once a month and like i said even some of the stuff you know lasts longer than that and don't have to and only have to like stock up on it again like every second month so not everything is done by the end of the month for the next month so yeah i hope you enjoyed this little haul and yeah thank you so much for watching and i will then see you in the next video. bye